South Carolina this morning. We're talking about it in this morning's Money Watch. And mortgage rates are headed back lower as well. Jane King is live in New York following these stories for us and more. Good morning, Jane. Hi guys, uh, good morning. Yes, mortgage rates fell for a second straight week and back below 3%. So in the week that ended November 11th, 30-year fixed rate mortgages uh, fell to 2.98%. Well, the global chip shortage is making it harder for shoppers to get their hands on some of the most sought after tech gadgets for the holiday season. iPhones, Google Pixel phones, of course, those video gaming consoles all expected to be or already are in short supply. Now, as a general rule, the consumer experts say that people should shop early and be flexible this year. And car insurance in South Carolina on the lower end of costs for among states. Bankrate says the median cost is $1,512 a year. Now, South Carolina says has an abundance of, of car insurers and among the best, according to Bankrate, are Geico and uh, that was according to their research and uh, consumer surveys. Well, stocks little changed yesterday. We still got inflation. There are also reports out this morning that the naming of a new Federal Reserve chair is imminent, so we will definitely keep an eye on that. Cryptocurrencies also plummeting this morning with Bitcoin now back below 60,000. Live from the NASDAQ market site, I'm Jane King. Back to you. Yeah, Jane, it's good to know about the car insurance considering just how many accidents we have on upstate roads, but also South Carolina roads in general. That's good to know. Yeah, no, uh, useful information. So, and interesting that it's among the cheapest of states. So that's positive. Hey, we like to hear that here in the Palmetto State. <laughs> yeah, we do, we do. Thank you so much, Jane.